Here are a few notes on sets. First of all, if A intersect B is phi, the empty set, then A and B are known as disjoint or mutually exclusive. And as you can see in the Venn diagram below, there is no overlap between the two. Their intersection is the null set. Second of all, for complement in the class, we will be using A prime. But other things are used by other authors. For example, A with a superscript star, A with a superscript C, or even A with a bar over it are used for complement. Third, the shorthand for union and intersection, and these, by the way, parallel the summation and the product symbols. So for example, if you want to write A1 union A2 union A3 union A4 a little more compactly, you can say the union from i equals 1 to 4 of a sub i. Fourth, there are other operators on sets other than the three that we hit, which are the union, the intersection, and the complement. So for example, there is exclusive or. And if you want to see what exclusive or looks like, draw a quick Venn diagram. Here is the set a. And here is the set B. Exclusive OR is kind of a strong version of OR. It says you can be in A or B, but not both. Finally, De Morgan's Law and the distributed laws are listed in the textbook.